I am a child of God. I am a child of God. I cannot live anywhere where things will be disappearing. It is not possible. It is not possible. I am a child of God. I'm a child of a living God. Not a dead God, a living God. My God is alive. He lives. I cannot be living anywhere where my things are disappearing. It is not possible. And it is definitely not of God that your things will just be disappearing. Why would my things just be disappearing? It is not natural for things to disappear. So obviously people are doing it. If you have taken anything of mine that belongs to me, return it. Return it or otherwise the wrath of God will be upon you. Return my things that you have taken. I don't know what you're using. I don't know what you're using, but I'm telling you to return my things. Return my money that you stole. I don't know what kind of witchcraft you used to steal my money. Return it. I can never live anywhere where my things will disappear. It is not possible. I reject it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every day I cover myself with prayers. Every day I cover myself with the word of God. I can never live in any environment where my things will just be disappearing into thin air. It is not possible. Return my things that you have taken from me. Or the wrath of the almighty God will be visited upon you because he protects his children. And I, Anusana, I am a child of God. I'm a child of the most high God. There is only one God. He created the heavens and the earth. And he gave us his son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, to die on the cross of Calvary. He sacrificed his blood for our sins so that even if our sins may be as scarlet, his own blood will make them as white as snow because he carried our sins. He carried our sins for us on the cross when he died. So I am asking you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, for your own protection and for your own good, leave me alone. Leave me, my stuff and my life alone. Stop using your witchcraft to attack me. Stop using your witchcraft to take my things from me. Return everything that you have taken from me. The word of God says that even if your faith be as small as a mustard seed, you will tell the mountain be removed and it will be moved. So I ask you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, move, move from this place. Be removed from this place in the mighty, most powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the name that is above all names. At the mention at the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Every knee will bow and every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is the Lord. He is the King of kings and he is the Lord of lords. He reigneth up until everlasting. He died on the cross of Calvary for me. He died on the cross of Calvary for me. Even for you listening to this, he died on the cross of Calvary for you. Even you who does not, who does not believe in God, he also died for you. So that if only you would believe, all of your sins will be forgiven. I cannot, I say it again, I cannot live in a house where my things will be disappearing. It is not possible. Anything of mine that has been taken, whether it has been taken through spiritual means, physical means, emotional means, any kind of means, they have taken anything they have taken from me. They will return it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Anything of mine that has been taken through witchcraft, spiritual means, any kind of means that they use to take people's property, they must return it in Jesus' name. I can never, I say it again and again and again, I can never live in a house, an environment amongst people where my things will be disappearing. It is not possible. Not when I believe in the most high God. Hmm? Not when I believe in God. Not when I believe in God. Mm. I can never live in, in an environment where my things will just be vanishing into thin air. It is not possible because I'm a child of God. Father Lord, you said that there is no prayer that we would pray to you in the name of your son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, who you sacrificed for us. You said that there is no prayer that we would pray in his name that you would not answer. 
I answer and I stand by the faith that I have in you, that my things, everything of mine that has been taken will be returned to me. In Jesus' mighty name I have prayed. Amen. And so shall it be.